Um, I had an experience this summer that was a first in my entire life, which is comprised of 64 years at this point. And for the first time ever, I went to camp with high schoolers. I really pretty much had a motto in my life that I don't do kids. I taught adults for over 30 years, Bible studies and worked with adults and trained people to work with kids, but never did I really think I wanted to do kids. So about 11 years ago, we started doing New Year's Eve parties at my house uh, for the youth group here on the island, and um, I got to know the kids through that contact once a year. I just felt a longing in my heart to start to connect with them more. Um, I fell in love with them. When I started actually as a leader, um, it was very interesting because I kind of held back and I tried to kind of hide in the kitchen a little bit. It's interesting how kitchen time brings out conversation. Kids who didn't really even know me started talking to me. I was just shocked at the deep, deep hurt in kids out there and I think that just drew me even more to get in with a youth group and get to know these kids so they can know somebody who can give them hope and love. Because they didn't, they, a lot of them just don't have it. And because there's not much to do on this island, about eight o'clock the island wraps up. We have a movie theater, but you know, you see the movie, then you have to wait a week and a half to see another movie. Um, without much to do, what the kids do is they go from party to party to party. These kids, a lot of what we deal with don't matter to anybody and so they don't think they matter to God and our job you know my job as a youth worker is to let them know that you do matter I really care about you and that's just a tiny little piece of how much you matter to God so I'm great I think I'm really grateful that God brought me in this later in my years because I can offer them something on a different level than if I was a young punk I feel very privileged to be able to be in a situation where I can really connect with teenagers on a real authentic level. I want to get to know who these kids are. I want to know their hurts and I want to know their dreams or their lack of dreams or whatever it is that's going on. And my playing ping pong with a kid on Monday night lets me speak into their life. Um, and it's awesome.